The railway structure is incredibly diverse and complex. You have the track, you've got the switches and the crossings, you've got systems such as telecommunications, electrification, signalling, and you've got the structures. And these are all made of different materials, all deteriorating at different rates, and we have to look to see how we can maintain those in an effective way. And Nottingham University is developing new mathematical and statistical methods to analyse the data that's available to understand how things deteriorate and then to understand the best way in which they can be maintained. We look at to see how things such as climate change, uh, natural disasters or deliberate acts such as terrorism can also disrupt the system performance. The national impact that we've got is, is evidenced by the contacts that we've got with the rail industry in the UK. We've got active projects with London Underground, RSSB, the Railway Safety Standards Board, HS2, and we're very active in the Transport Systems Catapult Centre as well. The strategic partnership with Network Rail started in 2009 and that was the start of our life as a group. The group's now grown since that time to, to now be over 30 members and this makes it the largest group in the UK and probably the largest group globally as well. We're aimed mainly at supporting their asset management activity and looking at how they can minimise their whole life costs. The challenge that interests me in this, this area is to make a difference, to have an impact and for the work that we do, the modelling work, to actually be used by industry to make decisions.